This is when it really gets tense. Only four teams remain in the biggest club competition in the world, and we're not far away from kickoff in the first leg. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello, it's a real pleasure to be with you from West London, from Stamford Bridge. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And now things get really exciting on the UEFA Champions League front. We're at the semi-final stage, and what we have coming up is the first leg. It's Chelsea, and they take on Lille. Well, Derek, it's said that semi-finals are the best games to win and the worst to lose. And while the hosts are clear favourites, I still think this could be a great match, full of individual... Chelsea, Edouard Mendy stands between the posts. Andreas Christensen plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. N'Golo Conte starts alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And the main threat in attack today will likely be Romelu Lukaku. So the initial 11 for Lille. Well, the 4-4-2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the full-back and winger, and of course the centre-backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. And underway now in this Champions League semi-final first leg. Now what can they do from here? Oh, big chance! Had to come up with the ball and did. Mount. And Havertz. Gives it a go. Oh, a tremendous block. Renato Sanchez. Well, every side needs someone to run the show in midfield, and Jorginho is well capable of that. What do you expect? Can he finish? And a goal! The opener in the semi final. First goal of the contest. Well, as you can see, he makes it look easy in the end, but I think that's a good finish. He'll be pleased with that. Well, away they go again. What effect will that goal have on Chelsea? We're going to find out. Aspili Quetta. Mount. Mount. A fine use of the ball. Mount. And still dangerous. Well, that's the end of that for now. Oh, he's really opened them up here. And he's in the clear. And another one. Two quick goals. Will it turn out? Two-punch knockout! 
Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So, 2-0 now. good piece of goalkeeping there and across the touchline so a throw in here showing considerable guile well in the final analysis it was good defending Havertz Jorginho now oh, that pass easy on the eye. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Renato Sanchez. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. Untidy in possession. Bamba. Wonderfully weighted pass. Excellent block by Thiago Silva. Bamba. Can he put it away? Not oh, covering up defensively. Kai Havertz. Mount. Aspili Quetta. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his booking there. Mount. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Marcus Alonso. Terrific block. Renato Sanchez. Losing possession here. Jorginho. Aspili Quetta. I must say, this looks promising. Havertz. Rudiger N'Golo Conte well read to ease the pressure illegal play and hence a free kick Aspiliqueta. He's given us away. And for more on the injury, let's go down to our reporter, Jeff Shreves. Feeling down here is that he twisted his knee when turning. He's been testing out ever since, but at the moment he's carrying on. Cheers, Jeff. following the deflection a corner kick coming up here well they haven't seen too many chances but the crowd sensing this could be a turning point they need a goal here now how about the short corner mount and space for him to cut in Conte here's mount it opens up for Havertz a oh, really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out?
Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, no danger now. Kai Havertz. The cutback. And so the first half draws to... Second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway. Aspili Quetta. Conte. This is Aspili Quetta. Christensen. What a creative look about this. And threading it forward. A goal! Well, here's the replay, and in many ways, it doesn't do justice to how patient they were in the build-up. Just so composed, waiting for the right moment. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Well, the match continues. The arithmetic having been altered by Chelsea. Bamba moving the ball nicely looking for that final pass useful looking position you've got to say Sanchez goalkeeper's ball across delivered too close to him Rudiger Conte has it. Given away by Chelsea. And options in the centre. Renato Sanchez. So Sanchez with it now. Bamba. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. And the ball's gone. Sven Botman. Here's Renato Sanchez. Well, attacking possibilities. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. He takes aim. Oh, he's found the net. And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. So back underway, 3-1 the score. N'Golo Conte. Aspili Quetta now. Mount. Jorginho. Now with Alonso. Scored not once but twice. They simply cannot stop him, and no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, here it is again. The build up is so patient, they're just waiting to play that killer pass at the right time, and then it's a pretty tidy finish, too. Hits it hard, he hits it low, and it just makes it difficult for the keeper. A really nice goal.
Underway again, and they're being treated to plenty of goals. 3-2 at the moment. Zegrova. Andre with it. And the ball is... Well, the keeper had a lot to do. Well, it's a great piece of goalkeeping. So quick off his line. Well, what support these Chelsea fans are giving the team. But time isn't on their side. They need a goal quickly. Jorginho. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. Aspilicueta. Lukaku might fancy it, you know. Oh, great header. Smart stop, though. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? Playing it in. Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Lukaku. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. Well, the corner it is, and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Played over. Well, a bit short with the clearance. Sends it back. How about this for drama? All even once more. Astonishing. Well, here it is again, and the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area, just poor defending all round. Back underway and level pegging at 3 3. Five minutes remaining and level pegging here. Andre. Can they nudge in front late on here? Bamba. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. Well, the referee won't be quite as lenient next time. Got to tread more carefully. And going short with it. Jose Font. Zegrova has it. It's with Celic. Well, possibilities in the centre. Magnificent goalkeeping, and still their level. Well, it's a top save, and it's an important one as well, Derek. That would have been it had that gone in. There will be three minutes added on at the end. And teammates to play it to. An attack full of promise. Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them? There's every chance, and the fans are lapping this up. Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal.
And the referee blows his whistle. That is the end of the contest and a fine result for the away fans. And if they can repeat this sort of performance on home soil, then they will surely be going through. Well, at this stage of the tournament, you'd take any lead going into that second leg. I tell you what, though, this tie is far from over. Very little to split between the two sides, and it's set up perfectly for round two. Well, there's a sound reason why.